cruel assassin. Assuming that's not the right character. Yeah, it's this one. ED trickster. Why do you have two? <laughs> Why do you have two shadows? You could have just like re-rolled this one if it was your first character. You can change your ascendancy. I don't know. You oh, okay. That's fair. That's fair then. What have we got? Hold on. Want to go bow shopping with me? I can help in a little bit for show. Sure. Build doctoring on stream at the moment. Yeah, it's all good. So, one really, really, really strong thing for a lot of common builds, such as ED Contagion, is going to be Ziz's guides. Zizarin, if you haven't heard of him, you should. Um, his guides are so, so, so in-depth. The dude has a brain the size of the galaxy, okay? And his guides literally game out. So you have 7,800 ES, which is a lot. Um, well, it's a fair bit. I wouldn't say it's a lot, but it's a lot for a soft core, I think. And you might have even more, actually, if you have Vol Discipline. You have Vol Discipline? Are you running Discipline? Where's your auras? Where's Discipline? Oh, there it is, Vol Discipline. Okay, yeah, perfect. 8.6, okay. So the reason I I league started this two leagues ago, and I didn't really like ED Contagion Trickster, because it wasn't tanky enough for me. And it didn't boss well enough. But, I might be able to make it work now that I've played a bit better. i played a bit more, rather. One really important thing to just look for early on is extra skill points. Sometimes people will just, like, have this one, and it's like, why do you have a lightning damage point? You know what I mean? You've got a really good um, setup here. What is this? Chance to block spell damage while affected by discipline. You might not even need that. You don't need that. This is only giving you 6% ES, because you're not using Purity of Elements, right? Are you using Purity of Elements? Shouldn't be. Yeah, no you're not. Get a lot of money, dude. Get some good gear. Do I just buy a new ring and take off Assassin Mark 1 for now? Yes. Bossing is atrocious. So that kind of comes with a build. Um, with this, by the way... You can run increased item rarity because Contagion always counts as the last hit even though ED is doing all of your damage. Just so you know. Literally a free loot instead of like Arcane Surge and then you can put Arcane Surge on Flame Dash. Something like that. Um, maybe you could put it on... You have Withering Step, Flame Dash, and Shield Charge. Alternatively, you could try... Do you have the Jewel? You do have Spreading Rot. Okay. So you're withering your bosses. I'm assuming you're using your Blight. As long as you're remembering to do that, that that'll help your damage a lot. Zip, zip, zoom around? Yeah. You may be able to drop, like... Say, faster attacks on this. And then move Fortify and Shield Charge somewhere. Put Flame Dash with Arcane Surge. Might be pretty good. Swap for bosses. Well, you don't have to swap the gym. You just need to apply this to the bosses. Use Vol Blight on them. Keep your ED up, basically. Yeah, I think ED is a way better single target. I wouldn't recommend swapping it. Um... Chaos dot multi level all chaos skill gems. If you need more bossing damage, you could go for a plus chaos plus all spells. Get rid of the attack speed and get rid of the dot multi, maybe? That might help? I actually don't know. 
That should be an upgrade. Because you do have Dom on this, which makes it kind of insane, as well as spell damage. You have attack speed, which helps your shield charge. I'm gonna break my item. Well, you would get a whole new item. Is the is the thing? You would you would just buy a new new uh, wand. <clears throat> what is the loading screen, by the way? So, the most fun thing about Chaos builds is they're really good early league because it scales off of gym levels only, or mostly, and then multi, which is pretty easy to get relatively. And so is like the plus one, just plus one rolls. Um, if you were to get an amulet with two plus ones, so plus one Chaos spells and all spell skill gems, or in skill and all spells, You'd be fucking just like chef's kiss shitting on the game. That will be a massive damage multiplier. Like if we go to... Essence Strain? We can sort by top DPS and look at this guy's necklace. Guaranteed it's plus two. Yep. All chaos, all int. Watch this. Literally 17% more damage. More. Multiplier. Because I'm on Kali right now? Yeah. Oh, he also has Iolite rings. Do you have Iolite rings? Forgot about those. So you have a Moonstone and a Two Stone. Moonstone, Two Stone. Carson is with Despair on hit. So you don't need to be running Despair here if... I, um, I feel like... Getting this is better than having one with on hit because on hit doesn't gain doom. Whereas if you self cast it, it gains doom, which means over time they'll start taking more and more damage and it'll have more and more of an effect. This I respect. However, I think it could definitely be upgraded really easily. If I remove the ring my DPS dips on POB, yeah, so that's because you're not putting on. He uh, Doom on your Hex. So let's let's set this up real quick. Use Ghost Shrouds, use Frenzy Charges, and I'm assuming you also have Power Charges and maybe Onslaught, DM Onslaught. Staunching, Warding, Grounding, Heat. I'm proud of that. Chemist, 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 Chemist. Jesus Christ. A lot of chemistry. You don't really need Chemist, but if it helps you, it helps you, you know? This has Transcendent Mind. Hell yeah. Um. You have Elusive most of the time, I believe, as that. Sure, let's say you've killed recently. Let's say you've cast a spell and blocked recently, crit recently, probably. You do have fortify from... Okay. You are always on full life, that's cool. So, you remove the ring. You do lose damage. I don't know why. It looks like maybe it's not counting it. What the fuck? <laughs> I'm just gonna change this number by one and see if that's what's changing it. That is what's changing it. Wait, is it counting? Hold on, hold on, hold on. I think it's counting... 14.7. I think it's counting the hex with this. Why is it saying you lose less damage that way?
Hold on. There's something else I gotta check before I move on. So you're doing the same thing. You have to cast this three times to proc this. So you want this to be low, low, lower level. I do like this idea though. Um, Arc Surge? I don't... How do you do this then? Like why is there despair and despair on hit? Uh, rings. I don't think you need despair on hit. Yeah, this guy doesn't even have despair on hit. And he's the... Insta kill both? I just made a lot of upgrades, yeah. I'm doing a lot of damage at this point, and I'm very happy for it. So he's not even on the left side of the tree at all. He's literally all over the right side. Tejun is 50 mana, and Surge is 40 mana plus? Oh, okay. I would, I don't know, I would still drop. I would go with increased item rarity if I was you, but if you're worried about the damage, I would, I would, I would keep it how it is, I guess, for the... Actually, it's still 10%, right? No, you had it at level 8. 14%, yeah, that's 4% more, I'd keep it. How you got it, then? So, is this on your left click, or is Withering Step on your left click? Because you're having... It's, Another thing for damage, you can level up your malevolence for skill effect duration. Contagion on right. Yeah, I just mean like how are you using your Tempest Shield and Cold Snap? I don't understand Cold Snap. What does this do for you? I guess it just chills them. And maybe it's the Frenzy Charges that you're using it for, but you should have Frenzy Charge generation through your... Oh... Listen, man. Personally, I didn't like having this, even though it's 20% more damage over time. I preferred this a lot. Because this guarantees frenzy and power charges against bosses. Whereas this does not. You feel me? That's why I prefer it. It's also cast speed. So, if you want to try that, I recommend testing it out, giving it a little bit of a testy poo, you know? Other than that, you do have that. Okay, so here you could definitely go with these instead of this. It's 2.4% damage. How do you have so much block? You don't have a, like, that many... Hmm. Do that next level, 98? Okay. Um, this is also very strong. Oh my god, why does my ear itch, bro? What shield are you using? Gloom Sanctuary Titanium Spear Shield. Recover 5% ES on block. That's really strong. Good job, okay. That's also a lot of ES. That's a good shield. That's a really good shield. You also have Endurance Frenzy or Power Charge on your block. You are indeed using Endurance Charges. Hella scam for that. 15x for that when I started. Alright. Dookie poopy. Upgrade it. That's dookie poopy. <laughs> How? It is... You can have a shitload more ES... And because you have a recover percent ES on block shield, having way more ES is going to keep your like I mean it's a good it's a good chess piece. I'm just memeing. Like I'm over exaggerating for memes, but How is this set? are you missing 1% quality? How's this 29 plus 17 is 46, right? What the fuck? You scared me? Yeah, no, I'm just giving you shit, dude. Don't worry. Body armor. Chevronis actually wouldn't be terrible for this. Um, but if you got a... Sh uh, sorry, a chess piece with ES base. Come on, guys. 
Somebody give me one with an ES base. These guys are trolling. They're all DPS. You want an ES base most of the time? This guy doesn't even have an ES base. What's happening here? Want to ES any evasion since you're boosting evasion too? Might be good. Looks like they're all doing that too, actually. Want that help with dodge? So, the thing about evasion is it is entropy based. Uh, unlike blocking and dodging, which you can do a billion times in a row if you're insanely lucky, obviously. That's funny. He has 8 to maximum life on a build with 1 life. Anyways. Um, it is entropy based, so after dodging or after evading a certain amount of attacks, you will get hit. No matter what happens, there's a certain point where you will get hit. And I feel like that's less potent than having more ES. Blood Rage is good on Toxic Rain. Very, Blood Rage is very good on Toxic Rain. Attack speed is insane. It gives you power charge gener or frenzy charge generation. Attack speed. Um, Leech is also pretty strong. Maybe your... Actually, your chest piece is pretty nuts. I don't know. It does have a lot of evasion and ES. I didn't think they would be using those, to be honest. Maybe evasion is stronger than I thought for this kind of build. Maybe that's why it felt like shit for me. 30% more damage over time. I'm assuming that's where your Blight is. Uh, socketed AoE. Yeah. Your build is actually fucking banging, dude. I think the thing is, this build just doesn't feel good against bosses unless you have insanely good jewelry and weapon. Um... I fucks with this ring. This ring is crazy. <laughs> God. Did you quality this? It doesn't look like you did. You can quality this with defense, by the way, and it'll give you percent increased yes as well. As the um, 54 and 30 implicit. Plus one, plus one? Yeah, so you want plus... Well, you can also get plus one on a shield, but I think the tankiness is a little bit more important here. Until your budget is tens of X. Ring is qualityed. Do they only roll up to 24? I forget Moonstone Rings. I thought it was up to 30. Because Blessed Orbs are super, super cheap to roll that. Implicit. Same thing with this. That's not important, but like, you know. Makes your life easy. I don't know why this will make you lose damage. You try Blessed Orbs? Got a shit ton of those? Yeah. I'd stop picking them up if I was you. If you want to use my filter, you're more than welcome to. My filter kind of bangs, I'm not going to lie. Um, I don't know, dude. I would say, mostly, it's going to come from upgrading your weapon and your amulet. That's going to be almost your entire um, upgrade path. This can also be 24 strength in the int, by the way, on the implicit, I think. Or is it 16? Dude, I'm actually losing my mind. I can't remember these bases. I didn't want to hear that. 60x upgrades? Well, no. I mean, you can get plus one on your amulet instead of, like, plus zero. And it'll be better. <laughs> White map dweeb to red map crusher Chad. True, dude. Can't confirm this filter bang.